Welcome back, everyone, to the channel. The match we have next is going to be awesome. Stay we are going to have an extreme have rules match against Con C C C Connor. Wait. Yo, Connor with a K, so you know he means business. And look at those chops. Look at those mutton chops, man. Those chops are deadly. Get ready to feel the buzz. It's buzz. Feel the buzz indeed. And here he comes. Making his way to the ring from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 250 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Madman Mac Daniel. There's been a lot of coverage on. Oh, here we go. Welcome to the wasteland. Oh, shite. Oh, uh, he looks menacing. An extreme rules match with this guy. I'm about to tell you. You know what? Let's go, boy. Off looking to outmatch each other. Let's go, boy. Float over DDT on the outside. I want to get this going. I'm bringing out my good old friend Larry the Ladder. You want the smoke? Oh no shit. Oh 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 oh, oh, oh no. Jeez, oh no. Oh on the damn ladder. Oh wow. Yo, I love these ladder spots. I love these ladder spots. Let's go. Can I see if I can get a get a third one down, huh? Ah, uh, here we go. He's gone. Look at this. Look at the butterfly lung blower right on the outside. Connor hurting a little here. To be expected, though. It's not Damn like right, he's, he's hurting a little. Slouch, guys. Hey, Arden, there were a slouch here. Yo, you want some steel? Take the steps. Take the steps right to the face, boy. The steps that'll make you reassess some things right on. I was gonna hit him right in the face. Oh, another one. Oh, and we got it right on the steel. And he's fired up, folks. Let's go. Let's toss him. If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free for all where absolutely anything can happen. Look at oh, that. Boy, he is I got the good old signature now. Let's go. He's fighting back here. Oh, I Connor with a nice reversal. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is cold. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious. And they're fighting on the outside here. Oh, right to my God. McDaniels oh, giving the punishment to Connor. They're going. They're going to keep going at it. They're going to keep going at it. There may be no way around it taking this loss. He gets out of here, folks. Of course, it's moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open. What a suplex on the outside. And a side effect. 
Looks like we're coming up on the end of Connor's. Let's here. go. Oh man, Connor really needs to dig down deep. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, I don't think I've ever seen John Cena manhandled like he was on that night. Yeah, Lesnar definitely Hold brought up. it to what Cena What did you think of there? Truly oh, elbow drop from the top of the, the stage! Wait, what, what's this here? Another elbow drop, but he misses it! No one home there, folks. Ah, uh, wait here a minute, wait a minute, what is he thinking he here? Oh, what a shoulder block! He's gonna pick him up. Beautiful technique. Come on. Let's go, Connor. Let's go, let's get out. Let's fight. If you just joining us, let's fight here, boy. Look at that flow over right on the LED stage. I'm just gonna walk here. Follow me, Connor. I'm on, let's go. Follow me. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Mm -hmm. Ah! Great job escaping, trying to turn this Gil, thing around. Connor. Oh boy, he is rolling. Boom! Gil. Face. Right onto the apron, man. As you Byron know what? Innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor this guy, he deserves it. The ring. He deserves it. No he deserves it. He deserves it. No, it's not cold, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. This guy deserves it. Get your ass in this ring, Connor, huh? Get your ass in this ring. Whoa, whoa, come on! Get off of me, you putts. Oh, oh, oh my god, he just set the table on fire! He just set the damn table on fire! Oh my goodness! He just Connor set the table on fire, folks. Oh, Connor with a nice reversal right here. Right to the spine. With Ooh, another backbreaker. Look at that! Look at this! Oh no! This could only mean one thing, folks. He's looking to do something drastic. By uh -oh. drastic, I mean dangerous. Dangerous spot for him to be in. He's got to figure out a oh, way to get back here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, oh, oh my goodness! Bro, like. I want him I want to put him through this, but how? Without a doubt, this is a volatile That's situation, thing, guys. But how? WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this. Oh, the suplex! <laughs> Bro, like, I want to get him down here. Table in play. Oh, Connor with a nice reversal DDT. Hard to argue Michael's point on volatility and the volatility of this match, but what Come I think on, oftentimes man. gets overlooked is the mental anguish. What does Buzz have in Oh, wow, wow, the shouting, the shouting, the shouting, the shouting. It connects. One, two, no. Oh, man, Connor really needs to dig down deep. No. Oh, the power bomb. Thing. Like what move can I use? Oh, the scoop slam right through the flaming table! My goodness, my goodness, my goodness, folks! In matches like this, guys, you learn very quickly. Which uh, I don't know what he's playing here, but I don't think it's gonna be. I don't think it's gonna be anything lethal here, folks. Oh. 
Oh, this is the buckle bomb. The buckle bomb, and it connects. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. The end is near for him. No, 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 no. The X-Plex right on the damn ladder. One, two, no. No. It is not over. It is far from over. It's not over yet, folks. It is not over yet, and he will take out the steel chair. Chair be flatter every damn time. Chair be flatter every time, bud. Chair be flatter every time. You should know this. Ah, curb stop! Oh, look at that flapjack. Oh, right on the outside. He's not going to like this. Oh, no. 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 Oh, Like it works sometimes, some days, and it doesn't work other days. Like I don't understand. This is a treacherous match indeed, as Corey was saying. I can't even tell you Ruff. how many. Oh, you gotta be Keo. I hit so that guy, man. Don't give me this bullshit. Medical facility. Yeah, but despite all those inherent dangers, these superstars still willingly sign up for extreme rules matches. That's what amazes me the most. Nobody controls the pace of a match. Hold up. Like Can I hit a heat seeker from the outside? He sick right from the top, right on the outside. My goodness. Bringing it back between the ropes. He's calling him up. He's close to being done here. Oh, what a rope flip. He connects this time. And I believe he's going to throw him in the ring. Oh, he could be looking for the corner. He could be looking for the bicycle knee strike. Ooh, Connects right there. Things just went from bad to worse for Connor. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I believe he's looking for the trifecta, the final, the shouting. That could be it. One, two, three. It's over. Your winner, McDaniels. I always thought it was strange to call it extreme rules when just about anything goes, as this incredible match showed. He's going to want to make sure he saves every minute of this match for his personal highlight. I'll catch you on the next one. I'm out. This one's over, and here's your winner. That's a big win any day of the week on any show in any arena, Michael. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big single.